Me and a friend decided to make the ULTIMATE WATER FOUNTAIN TIER LIST! Yeah, the content on this channel is pretty much everywhere, but I hope you enjoy. This is the LKLZS8WSSP <laughs> filtered water cooler with an enhanced, easy H2O bottle filling station. Oh, and the price on this bad boy is 1250 God. I, uh... I did not grow up with this one at all. My school was too fucking poor to afford any of this. So I, I encountered this uh, this water fountain just last year. And I gotta say, I, I gotta give it an S tier. Do you have any, uh, any thoughts about that? My school added it, and they only have one so far, but it was funny to get the... Uh, they count how many numbers you have bottles you saved, mm -hmm. and that at least boosted up a tier. So, it's a good rating. Yeah. It, ha it has great water coldness, and it's very smooth. It's not disgusting. This is the LK EZSAL. This is a classic. I think everyone's seen this one. I have to say, I'm, th I'm thinking I'm leaning towards A tier on this one. It it's not as cold as the other ones, but it is smooth. It has some smooth water. It's it's nice and, and room temperature. It's the perfect bathroom breakwater fountain. Yeah. You can go in. It has a silent button. No one even knows you're getting water. Yeah. Yeah. Eight to your death. Going big guns. Now this one right Small here, guns. I call it the fucking tower. You see, this one right here has a special place in my heart because I am a I was a very short person, so I couldn't drink this water fountain on my own in grade school. I had to get my friends help me drink this water fountain, so I had to get like on your back then drink it. So the memories came, that came from this one, it it's above a C tier. It's it's absolutely awful. It's not it's not cold. It's it's pretty much warm and it's not smooth, and it has no launch to distance. You pretty much have to put your lips on the little water spigot to get any water out. I don't know if it's a B or a C due to this. I think it should be C tier cuz if it caused you childhood traumas, that's that's going to knock it you down. But it builds childhood friendships too. Well, so does war. Uh, all right, that's a whole different scenario. <laughs> all right, this one right here. This bad boy's the Oasis PG-8AC refrigerated drinking fountain, energy slash water efficient. It's, uh, it's okay. It has no launch distance. Button's always jammed. Yeah, the, the, the front buttons never work. It's usually like the back left one that works. It really to... has no launch distance. And if you look around the little <laughs> hole where the water comes out, it's covered in like gunk. And it probably has oh. like chlamydia or something stuck deep down oh. inside of it. Water fountain cheese? It's not the worst, which is why I'll give it a D. Oh, did you just say fucking water fountain cheese? Alright, yeah. this one right here, I always call it the saucer. Because the only button that works at the front and the water comes out- The water launches sometimes over it. But, I mean, it, ha it has great launch distance, which means you won't be sucking on, on metal. The water is decent, it was smooth, a D or a C. See, now this next one I'm very familiar with. This is the one we're all familiar <laughs> with right here. The, the two, the two Pete. Uh -huh. <laughs> you see, this is the one where you're like, Hey, 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 Miss Recess Guard, can I go get a drink of water with my friend? And you go in out, like, during recess, and the taller one, it has more launch distance and it's smoother, but the, the lower one, it is always colder. <laughs> I'm not sure if you noticed that. See, I have bad memories with this one because I forgot this girl's name. Every time I would go drink from the bottom one because I was also short, I was drinking from the bottom one and that was usually where the girls would go, the bottom one as well. And I would just always hear just one, two, three, that's enough for me. <laughs> and I would have to get off or else I would get sent to timeout and it was just... It was so angering because the water was so cold. There's always such a a good a good drink of water. I'd say that's a B. I'd at least say a because it has everything. It just doesn't have enough launch. Fair enough. Yeah. Now this gray one. This is the more enhanced version of the previous one. This is the Haas 31,500 series high-low concrete pedestal drinking fountain. 
this one's just a step up from the previous, just because it has it's colder and has more launch distance. It's not much better than anything else. There's nothing much I can say besides B. Yeah. All right, this one right here, the Oasis. Is that P5 fuzz? CP. No, this is the shit. I'm not sure if you've had this one, but mm -mm. in the park in my hometown, they used to have this, and it never worked, ever. And when it did yeah. work, it would just like. It would barely even dribble out the top like like pre cum or some shit. It just did not work. <laughs> and at the top, it's not here in this photo, but at the top of my hometown, they had a fucking ashtray on top of it. <laughs> so if you wanted to go get like a drink of water, you just have to smell some hardcore cigs. There's nothing good about this. I say F. Considering that you have to walk next to a smoker to drink that. Now this yeah. one right here. This has been at every single zoo I've been to. Just the random water fountain sitting out. It has some launch. I'm not sure Warm. if you can see in the photo, <laughs> but there is actually water <laughs> under it from how much it launches. It just goes off the side and sometimes it leaks. It has some massive launch. The water's not good and consistent, but it's cold. It smells weird too. C is a good rating. Now this one. Yeah. This is just a random unnamed fountain. <laughs> it never works. I've seen this one at a few parks before. I mean, so after... Yeah, n it never works. It can't even do its one job. Now this one right here. By the picture quality, this one has some memories. It's almost the same as the first one in D tier, the Oasis. But the, the one bar is what makes the difference. Because it it solely depends on where you press the water fountain that it actually works. If you push it on the left side, it doesn't work. But if you push it on the bottom right, it works. It is you extremely have to know the cold, but it has no launch. So you, you practically have to tongue it down. You're sucking it like a baby breastfeeding. Yeah, from a it's... water fountain. This one might have to be a D. D tier? Mm -hmm, D tier. Fair. It's not, it's not powerful enough to be C or B. Well, that concludes the end of the tier list. My upload schedule will be quite literally everywhere due to college, but you should subscribe as I got more content cooking.